Hi everyone, welcome back to Guitar Image YouTube channel. Alright, today we are very excited. We have with us a Fender Custom Shop. Okay, this is a limited dual P90 in uh, black paisley tally relic finish. Okay, so uh, I've been looking for a P90 uh, semi hollow kind of a tally guitar for a while and I came across this one and it was too beautiful that I couldn't pass on it. All right, so uh, let me just quickly run down the specs of the guitar. Okay, so you can see that the, the neck okay, is very beautifully, uh, have a relic sanded down finish at the back. Okay, this neck is a 1056V. So it's a slight soft V, but relatively chunky. Okay, it's a 0.94 on the first fret and 0.97 all the way up to the 12th fret so it's uh, relatively on the chunkier side okay uh, the fretboard has a compound radius of 7.25 to 9.5 so that's what I like about the newer custom shops they, they do compound radius now and it just uh, allows you to bring the action of the guitar lower and it makes definitely playing more comfortable Okay, uh, what else? Uh, on the body is Ash body. Okay, the pickups. Uh, it's on the neck, we have the Fender Custom P90. Okay. Uh, and on the bridge is same, it's Fender Custom P90 as well. So not really specified uh, to a certain model. Okay, the control is a Fat 50 Dual P90 with a Tally 500K. Okay, uh... What else? Uh, we have the Holo Body FO. Okay, roughly that's about it. Okay, let me see if I missed out anything. Okay, the neck is also Flame Double A. And uh, yeah, I just like the, really love the finish of, of this guitar. Uh, the black paisley, okay, with, with some relic finishes. Okay, I don't know if you can see it, but I'm going to have some zoom up shots as well. So you can enjoy some of this uh, beautiful work that's being done on the guitar. Okay, standard three-way switch, uh, front position for the neck, center position for the two pickups, and the bridge position for the, the bridge pickup. Okay, volume tone control. So pretty standard. Okay, so the guitar is going into the quad cortex. Uh, again, it's the same patch. I've not even tweaked the patch at all. Okay, it's the same AC30 capture patch that I've used for almost all my videos. And uh, I've not changed any gain setting or what. So it might sound a little bit on the breakup side, even thicker than breakup side, okay, because uh, P90s are slightly hotter than single coils. But hey, just to give a good comparison between uh, from guitars to guitar. So if you check out the previous video, you can actually compare it side by side. Uh, it's The patch is the same. So what you're hearing is just the guitar difference. All right, so without further ado, let's jump in and check out the tones right now. Yeah.
All right, so we hope you enjoy the following demos. Okay, uh, this is one of the guitars that I really, really enjoy playing. Okay, and then the chunkiness of the neck, it's uh, it's really really something something that I really enjoy. Okay, the compound radius really helps um, uh, bring the action of the guitar, uh, allows the action of the guitar to go lower, and therefore making playing much more comfortable. Okay, the the FO itself, uh, the semi semi hollow, uh, makes the guitar very resonant. So even without without plugging in. It's a, it's a relatively loud guitar, like an acoustic guitar, right? It's loud. And the P90s just give that nice, slightly fatter tone as compared to the single coils, which I really, really love, but yet not losing that, that, that chime and that spank that I really want. Okay, so uh, I guess uh, this is my very first P90 type guitar. I believe there will be more to come. Alright, so if you like more of this kind of video, do give us a good thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for the latest videos. Okay, take care, God bless. I will see you real soon. Bye-bye.